The New Hampshire Bar Association has sponsored the We the People, the Citizen, and the Constitution in New Hampshire for 21 years. On January 11, students from three New Hampshire high schools made it through freezing rain to compete for the We the People State Championship held at the Legislative Office Building in Concord. The finalists were high school teams from John Stark Regional, Nashua North, and Milford. We the People immerses students in the study of the U.S. Constitution. They learn and discuss how it was created and how it applies to modern life. At statewide competitions, students present what they have learned in a format similar to testifying at a congressional hearing. Judges pose a very complicated question which students have in advance and can prepare an answer to when they are given four minutes uh, to deliver that answer. Then for the fo all following six minutes, um, the judges ask what we call follow-up questions. The students don't have them, and the judges uh, can use some that are given to the judges, but also think of their own, often based on the student's presentation to the opening question. The students' answers are judged by panels of volunteers composed of leaders from the judicial, legislative, and executive branches, as well as educators, law enforcement officials, lawyers, and others. This year's judging panels included justices of the state Supreme Court, a state senator, and a former U.S. ambassador. The challenging format also includes follow-up questions which test the students' ability to think on the spot and apply their knowledge to timely issues. The Constitution is definitely much more structured about checks and balances that will be placed on the branches and how long the president can be in office, how long senators can be in office. So I think the Constitution was more um, thought through. Teams are then scored on content and presentation to determine the winner. David Snyder of the Barr Foundation announces the winning team. On behalf of the, the team here today, I wanted to congratulate and present the check to Milford High School. Yeah! Milford High School now goes on to compete at the We the People National Competition in Washington, D.C. on May 3rd. Howard Zibble, who helped bring We the People to New Hampshire, says the program isn't just about the thrill of victory. The value of the program uh, to our youth is the knowledge that they obtain uh, in, on the Constitution and the Bill of Rights and the ability to engage in critical thinking, uh, not to judge these issues on the surface, but to have some depth to their knowledge, uh, be able to critically think about these issues. You really get to experience how you can apply the knowledge of the Constitution and government to like careers, and you see established people who are making money and making livings and have a career using the knowledge that you learn in class. The Bar Association thanks the Center for Civic Education and the New Hampshire Bar Foundation for its support of this program.